All right, welcome back everyone. We've just arrived at this pink tree area. Um, it's kind of interesting <laughs> how clearly some of the like sections of the game are very directly homages to stuff in The Witness. Um, I mean, the whole thing is <laughs> clearly, but it's kind of curious like how directly some of them are. Um, even though I'm sure the mechanics will be different, but this is still, it's touching on the same themes. But then how much of that is just because it's touching on, like, like, East Asian philosophy themes and all that kind of stuff. Because um, some of the imagery that's involved is related to that. Um, not just East Asian, like, Asian philosophy in general. Um, Anyway, um, also, <laughs> I'm kind of crashing from some coffee I just had, so we'll see how how well I do <laughs> in this state. What's this going to be? So clearly there's different heights here, so is it just going to be a case of, like, they do da 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 da? Yes it is. Okay, so the tall ones were filled in. However, it's going to like vary that up to certain degrees as I go. I wonder if we're going to do the, the thing where, okay, spoilers for the witness, skip forwards, 20 seconds if you don't want the spoilers um, where we're going to be looking at a tree from the wrong side and I actually have to do it backwards I wonder if that's going to happen anyway uh, so <clears throat> that was probably about 10 seconds not 20 seconds anyway so that 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 that, that. okay so they're all different heights here so we need to decide what does it even mean also the branches come out at different heights oh they're okay they're the same length like that's actually longer, that's longer, that's longer. So it's that one, that one, that one. Neat. So it's the length, not the actual height. That one's longer than that one. That one's longer than that one. And so on. Uh, that goes around there. Do I follow around this way? I guess I can. It's interesting that we're on the other side of this door. Uh, is it the same? That one's shorter, so longer, 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 longer? It's the same, okay. It's just double checking that I know what I'm doing. Now this drops down here. What happens if I continue north? Nothing, because there's nowhere to go. Ah, the binary section's up there, okay. The okie dokie, saw the binary on the hub thing. Ah, this door's open, okay. It's interesting that the cable goes all the way along the bottom. Some interesting rock formations. Hello. Okay, now we've got the irregular grid thing. What's that gonna mean? So that one's longer and that one's longer. No. What about if I fill in the bottom thing? Because I'm thinking like that could represent the length of that, and that could represent the length of that one. So it's not that. Hmm, what else is this going to be? Two... Oh, this is like branching. It's like uh, dividing into two each time. So we've got like this branch. I mean, it's not just that, right? No, I think I tried that already. For a moment I was thinking, is it like, just go for the the highest one and follow the branches to that? Let's see, can I actually see the next one? Is it not powered? It's not powered. But I'd also quite like to get to that map thing. Is that on the back of here? It doesn't look like there would be space, but there it is, okay. Whoop. It looks like we have, whoa, there's a bit missing down there. At the start, kind of curious. So it looks like there's maybe two bits at the top, like binary and something else, and then maybe one here, it's, or maybe two, I'm not totally sure. Okay, how does this work? I see it branching, and there's four things at the top. Two branches. Oh, so this branch is longer. So long branch, long branch. Doesn't matter about the like the actual flowers like this okay got it got it got it got it so long branch long branch 
long branch. Oh, interestingly, this doesn't split again. So I guess it's just going to be that and that. Cool. That's cool. Like, this is a cliff, so <laughs> the line continues up there. Is there something over here? Oh, it just also goes right there, okay. I guess I'll come out this way. Up here, what's down there? Have I been there? I don't think I have. Uh, I guess we're going here. Alright, uh, so... Long branch, although that might be counting as a long branch, to be fair. Oh gosh. Sorry I got interrupted for a second. Uh, what am I doing here? I am... Oh yeah, I was wondering about the length of these... Um, of these branches. Okay, so like, because that could be a long branch. And that could be a long branch, and that could be a long branch. What counts? Or is this just about which way it branches? Like, we branch, like, the, the long direction is to the right, then to the left, and then, like, both? Mm hmm. No, it's not like that. <clears throat> like, that and that are similar lengths, so let's just put them both in. That maybe looks longer? But then I have no idea, both. Hmm. So I'm getting this completely wrong, I guess. Like, this bit at the top is very obscured, so there's got to be more to it, right? Oh, unless it's, it's not this tree, is it? Although, uh, that divides up in lots of weird ways. This is also accessible, but that's probably for later. Hmm. Right, left. Okay, but I don't know why. Right, left, then what? Then right, apparently. For what reason? Can I think of another reason this would be like this? It's just the way it continues, but it doesn't continue after that point. Right? Left, but I don't know what happens. Apparently left. Is there something else that clues to this? Is there some other tree nearby? Maybe the next one will help me understand. Whoa. So branch split. Okay, I think I'm not understanding this in general, maybe. The right hand side, it so it does split into two at the beginning, and then this does split again? Yeah. And that one's the longest of those two. And of the beginning split, it's like that. Okay, let's just go with longest again. So then here, here, here? Okay, well, so I understand that one. Oh, I can sort of see the branches here. I thought that was the path through the, the, the leaves. Okay, okay, that explains it. So it's longest, longest, and longest there as well. Okay, I thought I was just seeing the path. Huh. All right, because it is a very similar color. If not the same color, maybe that's intentional. Okie dokie. Um, oh, we're almost at the torch. Yeah, it's funny how I had like one video where I got three torches done and then a whole bunch where I got much less done. This is covering up the screen, but that's fine. So we split into three here. Of these, that one's the longest, then that's medium. So let's just go with that. Let's assume it just wants the longest. Then of the next two, well, that. And then of these two, that. Then on the middle branch, longest is that. Then that, then that. On the left branch, longest is that. Ta-da! I can work with trees. I'm smart. 
super smart. When's this gonna open up? <laughs> Maybe when I do this. Mm, left. On the next one, right, because it like it bends all the way up there, and then right there. And here, the left. On this side. That one's the shorter one, then that's the longer one. I'm basically picking one on each division. So that was, that was that. And up here it's that one, and up here it's that one. Ta-da! That still did not open this. It's just a little bonus puzzle to check that I know what I'm doing. Cool. Another area complete. So let's try and get to that, um binary area. Uh, it's gonna be, I'm gonna have to go around, aren't I? Like along here maybe? How does one get there? Like this, all right. Is this somewhere? Nope. Um, that's something I've done. Right, yeah, I came through here. Oh, okay. So I probably came up to this before and then just left it. Uh, we're probably like oaring stuff. Or, or. Okay, <laughs> it's exclusive or. I had to decide what I was doing, just a, a normal logical or an exclusive or, inclusive or exclusive. Um, okay, there's a bunch of binary here, which is just counting. One, two, three. Uh, zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So it goes like that, like that, like that, like that, sure. And the uh, different colors, which is probably relevant somehow. <clears throat> so probably we toggle for every single one. Okay, it's the same answer as the one below, right? Let's say toggle, toggle, uh, toggle, toggle. I wish these were in line with the, the things. But maybe that would make it too obvious. Toggle, 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 toggle. Okay. I got it. I got it. Oh, got snowy trees up here. It's Christmas. Toggle. Toggle, toggle. Um, uh, off, off, on, off. Yay, what did I do? Nothing, I learned something. Um, I was wondering, for a moment I was like, is there a, like a hamming code here? Is that what it's called, hamming code? Oh, I've forgotten everything. Oh, uh, what is a hamming code? <laughs> What's the thing called where you, it's like a different way of counting in binary where you you always toggle one bit at a time. If my mind's saying something about gray. What's the hamming code? Okay, I'm just gonna look stuff up. Let's do some research. What? Hamming code. Oh. Right, that's to do with error detection, right. I'm like... Hmm, like having a parity bit. Oh gosh, yes, that stuff. Gray code, is that a thing? Gray code, that was right, okay, it is gray. That's where you toggle one bit at a time, right? Is that my remembering the right thing? Two successive values differ in only one bit. Yes, okay. Named after Frank Gray, also known as reflected binary code. I did not know that. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> Going back to my information theory studies, which is actually one of my favorite, was one of my favorite topics at university. Like talking about compression and various things. What's going on up here? Let's go into the Christmas land. 
Can I walk onto here? Nope, that's high up. It's a very large area. Oh, it's one of these. What are you doing here? Ah, wait, there's a few. Wait, where am I right now? Where am I right now? I'm to the, oh, oh, the white cable that came over here. It, it comes to here. Ah, interesting. What's this one? Oh, it's one of these. Okay. Pair them up. Pair them up. Not like that. Also not like this. Although... For some reason I thought this was going to work. It's not going to work. No. That's not paired with that. That can't pair with that, because then that'll never pair with that without going through three yellows. So that is pairing with either that or that. If it pairs with this, then it can't cut through this yellow, because then you're cut off. So those two yellows have to go together. I can put two yellows in with this. Um, but it seems like no matter where I do that, I have issues, right? Um... Unless I do it like... No, I think I have too many issues like that. So I think you are going with you, actually. And how am I separating... Oh. That's way too much stuff. That doesn't work. Two blues, two yellows. Then, then, you with you, somehow, without having two more together, that's not going to work. Hmm. So it's not you and you, because then you two can't pair. Correct. So it's you and you, or it's you and you. If it's you and you... You two are there, which is maybe fine if I can find some way of dividing this up, which I can't. It doesn't matter which two things I take, there are problems with all of them. Yeah. Okay, so it's you and you. They can't go around this way. Hmm. You and you. Maybe include those. One, two. Interesting. I have two left over though. Can I cut off another? Mm. I think I'm going to have a thing that exists purely to cut two sections off from each other, but I'm not exactly sure where. Like there or something. That would have to be off now, to not be part of that region. That would also have to be, uh, unless it becomes part of that region. There we go. <laughs> Got it eventually. And this leads down to, oh, here, okay. All these vines are gonna mean anything. I don't think so. I think there are just like various things in the environment that 
It's funny seeing them like, ooh, the effect of them swinging because of the large size of the pixels. You can see it like rippling up. I do appreciate that the, uh, the particle effect from my fairy thing. Um, I think it's pixel aligned. It's hard to tell exactly. Yeah, I think it moves by a pixel when I, I move. So I think the whole game is rendered at that pixel resolution and then scaled up maybe. Because the effect also appears to be like that. Anyway, it looks like there would be a cave here, but that's just wiggling around. Yeah, okay. Um, well, so these disagree with each other. Are we doing a, is this gonna be the binary? Are we combining the two? We are, okay, interesting. Very interesting. What's out here? Oh, oh, map. One in the middle. Oh, okay, the entire top section. Hello. Graveyards. I guess these do look like tombstones. Sure. Zero, one, two, three, if we flip it. I see the star symbol on there and the lines on here. What's that going to mean, if anything? Okay, what are you? It's not just going to be the same thing, right? Or it is. <laughs> okay. You, you. It's, it's going to throw a twist at me some at some point, right? Maybe. Like, maybe I'm actually doing something else here, not what I think I'm doing. And it's going to trick me. Uh-oh, we're like misaligned, so maybe it's... Uh, well, it's just shifted over, right? So I can still do uh, 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 uh. Okay. There's an interesting thing about puzzles like this where you kind of like... You break the format of the puzzle, like you play with the constraints and the boundaries of the puzzle. And there's an interesting thing about like, you've got to make sure that, sure, you're like breaking it in this way, but is there... Is it possible that somebody could interpret it a different way that also leads to the right answer? And you've got to be really careful. Like when you're dealing with interpretations of the puzzle, which you are at this point, like once you start doing this stuff, you're getting into like lateral thinking territory and any kind of like environmental, like connecting things to the environment. Like what if somebody else uh, like counts the bricks behind the puzzle and it happens to give the same answer? Like that's the kind of thing you really want to avoid. Otherwise you end up getting people trapped, <laughs> like thinking about something that's wrong. Just a pretty interesting aspect of these games. Did I see symbols like this anywhere else actually? Like where it was the binary symbols overlapping each other. <laughs> so that's two zeros, that's two zeros, that's two ones, that's one zero, one zero. Got it. <clears throat> now that is two ones. That is a one zero, one zero, one zero, two ones, one zero. Got it. Got it. This is going to be these up here. Although, what's that at the beginning? Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three. Four. Okay, so it's not including the dots. I guess there always was a dot at the beginning. Yeah, okay, so for each line there were two dots at the beginning. Okie dokie, so that's a that's a one zero, one zero, that's two zeros and so nothing. That's two ones and so nothing. One zero. Go. And the door opens. This is the very top of the map, so it feels quite important. Okay, we've got these um, like floodlight type things, um, reminding me of the sun temple, desert temple thing in The Witness. What's going on here? Is that the wall of the cave? Or I can't quite tell. Like clearly there is a wall here, but like 
texture in this bit is kind of confusing. Oh, that might be the wall going up, continuing from this. Like, is there just a rock face going above? And then that's the surface on top, maybe? Okay, let's do this. <clears throat> okay, now we've just got them in a the line, so it's going to be like, uh, 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 yeah. Like, these could be placed on top of each other, but they're not. Oh, but the dot's in the middle, so this is probably going this way. I reckon this is going to be, because there's no dot over here, I reckon it's going to be duh, 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 duh. <laughs> I got it. I got it. I know what you're doing, game. I know what you're doing. Uh, cancel, 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 cancel. So nothing. Yes. Hmm. <clears throat> Oh, this is fun. Okay. Um, cancel. Cancel. No cancel, no cancel. Cancel. No cancel. <clears throat> so, one. Oh, interesting. So, the, one and a one. Uh, so, cancels. This is two zeros, so zero and a one. Oh, this is gonna get complicated to read. Actually, how do I, oh, it doesn't matter which one's which. Yes, because it's commutative. Zero and a one, on. One, zero, on. Two ones cancel, so it's gonna be symmetrical, right? Yes. <clears throat> do these overlap like only in the middle? I bet they do. So this, 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 not the next one. Oh, I'm losing track. I'm at the fourth one, fifth one, cancel. Okay, these don't overlap in the middle. In fact, oh no, they do eventually overlap because this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, they overlap here. So I think the last two are on. Yeah, okay. Because like for the last two, it was like, one and zero, and then also zero and one. <laughs> Whoa. This is clearly gonna start having them overlap, but not, because like all of these were, well, like, yeah, the, the two that were overlapping here in the middle were both like either a zero and a zero or a one and a one, so it was easy to read. But outside we had ones where we were overlapping ones and zeros, and that's gonna start happening. Okay, it's the final puzzle. It's happening now. <laughs> I do like it when the game when the game knows like when to stop with the thing. Like this is obviously wh where this had to end. <laughs> um, and you could keep making more of these, but like it's it feels about right to just like end it now. So, and I'm sure like one of these will appear somewhere else as well. Okie dokie. So we have one and zero. We have, how do I know? It's either a zero or a one. How could I possibly say? Interesting. Do I have to like, maybe both interpretations are gonna work. So say interpret that as a zero from the right hand side. So it's zero and a one, so they go together. <clears throat> then the next one's gonna be a one and a zero, so that's on as well. And the next one's gonna be a zero and a one, so that's on. And the next one's gonna be, oh, it's gonna be symmetric, right? Yeah, of course it is. So it's gonna all be filled in. Mm -hmm. No, hold on. Maybe it's not going to be symmetric. No, it's not, because once they get back to that one, so one and zero, but I have to interpret that the other way. So that one's going to be off, that one's on. But then the last one will be on. Interesting. So my what I'm curious about is whether this also works. It does, okay. So it allows you to interpret it either direction. Cool, we have another flame. We did, did we get a flame from the pink trees? We didn't, did we? Or did we? Oh, we did. So I think I might have got two flames today. Should we go and check? Let's go have a look. It's 
Let's run down here. These weren't part of anything. It's kind of curious. Are there secrets or are they just there to be decorative? I can't remember which way I came up. I've done all that stuff. That was my tutorial for the binary. Down here, we see a tree. Is there... I mean, there are long branches and short branches, so... <laughs> you could be a puzzle. Oh, and there's that pink tree on the left that I could go back to as well. Why is that not lit? Huh. Wait, what? I've solved that puzzle. I've done a lot of stuff. Wait. <gasps> I have a puzzle. Except I don't know how that rule works, so I can't actually do it yet. <laughs> Wait, so isn't that thing... The torch from the middle? Why isn't it lit? Huh. Potential bug, potential not bug. Remember, this is pre-release, so... If it is a bug, that's okay. Oh, did not mean to walk down here. If this is all solved. I guess there's I guess there's more stuff over here that I haven't actually done. So maybe I'm not done with this area, but then I'm not sure which symbol on the thing this would be then. Or like on in the hub area. So trees, what, what is that? Isn't that it? I don't, yeah, I think that is it. That's like a symmetrical set of walls, binary, dots, diamonds, something. Actually not sure. Sh shapes, there's the lines and the, no, isn't, wouldn't that be that thing? I didn't get a torch there either. <laughs> okay, there's still loads of stuff I need to like finish off. Maybe we should try and figure out if there's more to do over here. Um, we'll do that next time though. We're making pretty good progress though. I do wonder like how long this game is going to be. I think it might be fairly short, but that's like something I'd be very happy with. Um, but then there might be like plenty of bonus stuff to do as well. So we will see. I'll be happy with either. Because this is a very pleasant time. All right. See you next time for more puzzling, <laughs> of course. Okay, goodbye.